Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome to another Daily Video Devo. Renee here. I'm actually heading down a trail into the En Gedi Ravine, which is an oasis in the desert. And that's where I want to go in today's Daily Video Devo. Surrounding this oasis is the lowest desert on the face of planet Earth. It is the barren, the desolate Judean wilderness. Behind me, you see the Dead Sea. It is literally dead. Nothing can live in it. Yet I'm walking down into the En Gedi Oasis. It is fed by a spring. It is lush with waterfalls. And this is where David hid from King Saul when Saul was trying to attack him. But I want to focus on the desert and the Dead Sea versus the lush ravine as a spiritual metaphor. You know, anger and bitterness and thoughts of revenge can make our soul as dead as the Dead Sea, as dry as a desert. But when I forgive, my soul can be as lush as the En Gedi Oasis. David wrote in Psalm 37, a really fascinating psalm that was written right here uh, while Saul was pursuing him. David says, refrain from anger and turn from wrath. Do not fret. It only leads to evil when evil people are pursuing you. So when things are going wrong in your life because of people doing you wrong, here's how to do right. David says, and again, that's Psalm 37 verse eight, refrain from anger, turn from wrath, do not fret, because thoughts of fretting, of worrying, and thoughts of anger and revenge, David says, only leads to evil. That will only turn your soul into a desert. Instead, he says, hope in the Lord and you will gain an inheritance. Hope in the Lord, in his sovereignty, in his grace, in his love for you, and then your soul, even when you're surrounded by tough times, it's gonna be like an oasis in the desert. But if you don't hope in the Lord and trust in his sovereignty, if instead you give in to anger and fretting, then your soul is going to be as dry and lifeless as the desert and as the Dead Sea. So again, Psalm 37, 8, do not give in to anger. Do not rage when people do evil to you. Do not fret. It leads only to evil. Instead, put your hope in the Lord. Remember that, and you'll have an oasis inside your soul. God bless. Have a great day.